We have a potentially delicate situation on our hands. Officially, once Washington shut down the SR-71, we haven't had a high-speed manned reconnaissance aircraft. Unofficially, it's called Aurora, and one just went down deep in the heart of the Denikil. We need to destroy the wreckage before the locals get their hands on it. The last thing we need is for whatever's left of our classified aircraft to go on the international auction block with Colonel Walday banging the gavel. The good news is that the region's been blanketed under a sandstorm until recently. That means that the Ethiopian troops in the area haven't had a chance to salvage the wreckage. Our best estimate is that there are three significant chunks of the Aurora left scattered along the length of a dry riverbed. Find them and plant charges on each. They'll be detonated 30 seconds after you plant them. So move quickly. You'll also want to take out the Ethiopian outpost nearby. We don't think that they've managed to salvage anything, but it never hurts to be sure. Take the site and then get out of there. Return to your insertion zone for pickup. Assuming the weather stays clear, the choppers will be there in a hurry. There's also a small supply dump in the area. If you can take it without too much risk, do it. Be warned, though. Enemy light armor's been spotted in the area. It's been immobilized by the storm, but now that the weather's cleared, you're likely to run into it, and sooner rather than later. This one needs to be quick. Advance at all costs. Full throttle. First charge set. One more to go. He's history. 
Goodbye. Another kill. Scratch another one. Another kill. Enemy down. Enemy down. Another kill. Scratch another one. Scratch another one. Enemy down. Scratch another one. Enemy down. Enemy down. Scratch another one.
Catch another one. Scratch another one.